We have breaking news to report. And uh, Eyewitness News is projecting that Rhode Island Governor Gina Raimondo will get four more years. And at the Democratic headquarters right now is Eyewitness News reporter Tim White. We'll uh, toss it to Tim right now. But uh, Eyewitness News projecting the governor will win re-election. Tim. Yep, you can come to me. Okay, uh, Mike and Shannon, as you can see behind me, uh, the applause went up when the both of you announced that Governor Raimondo was going to be reelected for four more years. Uh, obviously, the news that they've been waiting for here, they were very optimistic, as, uh, as I told you, because voter turnout was so high. And as you heard the executive director of the state party say, especially in the urban areas, that's where they put a lot of effort into their ground game and it paid off. They're chanting right now four more years, as you can hear in the background, and people are just filing into the garden room on the second floor of the Providence Biltmore. Obviously very excited by the announcement, and I think people in the hall, to be fair, had no idea uh, that we had called it because uh, that is where you go out and get your refreshments. And then when they heard the cheering, everyone started pouring in uh, to learn that Governor Raimondo uh, has been re-elected. They are now chanting Gina. I have to imagine Gina Raimondo right now, the governor is at her house uh, on the east side and she's starting to put her jacket on. She's going to hop in her car and drive over to the Providence Biltmore where after she presumably talks to Francis Mayor Alan Fung is going to give her a speech. So we're obviously bring that to you live when it comes for now. Mike and Shannon, I'm going to send it back to you.